Hello everyone, so it's me, Zara, coming to you live and direct from her apartment in Michigan. So, it's been a while since I've video blogged, vlogged, whatever you want to call it, and I uh, just wanted to say hello. So, a lot of my quotes lately have been, or status messages have been on relationships, or have had to do with self-worth, and um, those things, it's been, it's been weighing on me quite a bit. Um, I have been missing my father you know quite a bit and it's just funny because we used to have conversations all the time and all the time he would tell me about how a man needs to treat a woman and how a woman should treat a man and one of the things he used to always say is Zara you know your daddy love you right and I would say yes daddy and he would say every man who wants a woman will give anything and everything to make sure him get that woman. So make sure when a man come into your life that him can take care of you, that him love you, and he's willing to do anything for you. And it's funny because you know, I've been dating here and there and talking to people and things have, it just seems like things have changed. People are not really courting the same, people aren't chasing the same. Um, and just conversations don't really flow, but I guess that's what it comes down to. It's just not the right person yet. It's just not meant to be. And people always ask, well, what are you waiting for? Why aren't you going to put yourself back on the market? The way I see it is when the right person comes along, it's going to gel, it's going to mesh, and it's just going gonna, gonna to be perfect. God is not done with me yet, and therefore I have not out and with the person I'm supposed to be with. When he finds that right person or is finished working on him or finished working on me, then we'll be together. And that's just the way it is. And that's for everyone. Because at the end of the day, why settle for just anything when you could be patient and wait for the one? The one that you're going to have this amazing life with, great experience, you're going to be able to talk to about anything, and they'll be your best friend. Because that's really what it comes down to. You should be best friends with your significant other, with your partner. They should love you for who you are, the quirky things that you do, and vice versa. Their flaws should be perfections to you. Their flaws should be things that you either find cute or you just shake your head and say, oh my gosh, but that's just them, you know? And that's just the way it works. Yeah, you might have arguments here and there, but that's... That's life. Everybody argues and might have like little disagreements, but you learn to talk through those things. But that's kind of just what I wanted to talk to you guys about today, is really believing yourself and knowing your self-worth. There is nothing wrong with having standards. There is nothing wrong with if you meet somebody, it seems great, and then all of a sudden, you, you mean, things happen that you don't like. If it just doesn't work out, it just doesn't work out. But be honest about it. Stop leading people on. Stop you know, dragging situations out because you feel bad or just be open in communication because it saves a whole lot of time and at the end it saves a whole lot of feelings and emotions becoming confused and distraught. So that's my little message for today. I love you all and keep moving in faith. Mwah.